auto installer I have the package installed but please go ahead and install it if you haven't yet and the next step is to load a sample data set I'll just copy and paste it and we have the list of variables here so let's say my let's say my goal is to model a diabetes against a set of predictors so what if we run this regression model here since diabetes is a dichotomous variable it has values of 0 and 1 so 0 is for no diabetes and 1 is has diabetes we have sex for male and female we have race for white black and others we have bp systole and we have hgb which is hemoglobin it's somewhere here hgb yes hemoglobin level all right so let's run the model so here is the output and let's go ahead and make a plot so simply type coef plot it's going to give you the results but it doesn't look good currently because of the constant which is an extreme value we can we can drop the constant by typing drop underscore constant here we are we have a much better looking graph um so right now we have the coefficients but we can also plot the odds ratios by typing e form e form will convert the coefficients to odds ratios okay here we are we have the odds ratios now and we can add a reference line to make the chart more readable by typing x line since it will be on x axis let's say one okay now we know which one is what so looks like blacks are more likely to have diabetes than others systolic very insignificant hemoglobin on the line no okay let's take a bit deeper with what i can do okay we can also show the levels so if we want to show the levels we can uh, type this few items here let's call the command and so m level does show the levels m level position shows the position of the odds ratios on the chart and rescale it converts the uh, the decimals into uh, rounded figures and format okay so we don't have one here it goes far beyond so we have to change the x line here to let's say 100 okay now we have a much better looking picture right so if you are not happy with the position of the or ratio levels you can change it by going to let's say not two but mm, three well it, it doesn't look good it overlaps with the lines so let's keep it two. all right we could also merge different variables uh, different charts together let's say we want to run more than one models 
so this is our first model what if we want to see the results only for only for uh, sex region what if we want to see only for if region is equal to one okay this one is empty and we're going to store this result so we're going to show estimate store model one our next model will be for the second region let's say region two and we're going to store that as model two and this time we are going to call quave plot model one and model two and we have the overlapping models and the rest of the things are the same you just drop the constant if you don't want and add an x line let's say add an x well let's do that later let's first see the odds ratios okay so we have one here let's let's call an x line on a zero no let's call an x line on one much better and then of course we can show the odds ratios by adding these few details and here we are oh no what's happening here we have to change the rescaling drop the rescaling and x line to yeah x line is one okay perfect so the blue lines refer to the region one and red lines refer to the region two so in region one women have a higher likelihood or odds of having diabetes compared to those in region 2 all right i hope this helps thank you for watching